What makes people buy the specific products that they buy? Sure, our decisions are influenced by what we like and what we don't like. And often enough, we simply buy a product because we're used to it. For example, because our parents bought it. But sometimes there's another reason. Sometimes we are attracted to a product simply because we saw it advertised. And the next time we see the product in a store, we buy it. Maybe to try it out for the first time. Or simply because the ad reminded us of how much we liked it the last time we bought it. Whatever the exact reason may be, what counts is that in the end most companies advertise because they want to sell more of their products. Which leads to the question, how many more products did they sell because of advertising? To answer this question, advertisers can look at GFK's Media Efficiency Panel, a unique research tool in which people from all target groups constantly report what media they use, how often they see advertising, and also what products they buy. For researchers, this means that they can look at a single source for all the information they need to analyze how exposure to advertising influences people's purchase decisions. GFK, one of the biggest research vendors in the world, has run close to 70 studies on this over one and a half years. And here is what they found out. On average, after one exposure to advertising on TV, a person's tendency to buy a product rises by 19%. Ads on YouTube, however, are even more effective. They increase an individual's buying behavior by 40%. And that's not all. As GFK understands how many additional products are sold because of advertising, they can calculate a return on investment. Let's suppose that an advertiser invests one euro in TV and another euro in YouTube to show his ads. While TV pays back 27 cents in immediate sales, YouTube proves to be clearly more efficient, returning 1.03 euro on the short term. This makes YouTube the most efficient medium in the media mix after Google AdWords. And thus, advertisers should integrate YouTube and Google AdWords into their campaigns. At least, if they want to make the most out of their advertising money.